like I'm double fisting coffee right now. Well, yeah. we do like the party. Testing, 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 testing. And we're going home. We leave tomorrow to head back to North Carolina. Testing, testing. Is it recording now? And uh, uh, uh. <laughs>
post about where we're at and things like that after we've left that area. And I'm still a little funny about sharing exactly where we're at and what times, but kind of realizing if I want to wheel with people and meet some folks, then I probably need to. So we're going home and we're going to be there for three weeks, right toward the end of April. I got to make a pretty hard drive and go to wide open design. March. March, end of March. I'm going to go stay at wide open design do some things with uh, Adam over there for the channel. And then uh, we wake up the next day and we'll go to St. Louis, Missouri for a long weekend. So we wanted to share the schedule a little bit, uh, not so much exact dates, but you can follow along the order. And you know, if you wanna go wheeling with, with me or whatever, show me around, reach out, we'll see if we can make it work. Uh, wide open design, I gotta go to wide open design and then we go to St. Louis, Missouri for a week, apparently. You're not buying a buggy, right? Well, I mean, I don't talk about buying a buggy, but we'll see. Um, we're going wide open design. And then we go, I wanted to go to St. Louis, Missouri. Yeah. And then we go to S'more, Southern Missouri. I hope this camera doesn't fall <laughs> over. <laughs> back and forth right now. Uh, Saint, we're going to Southern Missouri Off-Road Ranch for a long weekend yeah. and then moving over to, not, I'm not staying at Green Acres, I'm staying at a campground right close to Green Acres so I can run over there for the day. So In Oklahoma, which yeah. I wanted to skip that state altogether. She's of, scared of tornadoes. I am, and it's like Mother Nature is like, here, let's just make your biggest fear happen and let's do all these tornadoes right now. I'm gonna take my risk because I've always wanted to wheel at Green Acres. And, uh, but I think I'm gonna be at Green Acres during the week, right? Weekend and then we're staying during the week. I don't know. I need someone to show me around Green Acres. And uh, then we move to- Then we go to Rugged Mountain Ranch. Rugged Mountain. That's the weekend. Yep. Uh, Rugged Mountain Ranch and we're the first of April we're in the first of April yeah right around first of April and then we are gonna push pretty hard and go straight from there we're just gonna go right across Texas although I do have a surprise stop for you in Texas it's along the way and uh, oh there will be Bucky's because I need beaver nuggets <laughs> and then we are going we're just gonna make our way from Oklahoma We'll stop along the way for a few nights and rest, but right around middle of April, supposed to be in Black Canyon City, Arizona. I'm getting together with a few people out there. We're gonna do some good wheeling and see how my school bus of a buggy does on some Arizona wheeling. And then we have a week long gap. We don't know what we're doing. Yeah, I gotta figure that out. Yeah, uh, something near the Grand Canyon. And then we're hitting one of my bucket list items. The Grand I'm Canyon. Super excited about Grand Canyon. And then uh, up to Sand Hollow for two months. First of May, I'll be in Sand Hollow till the end of June. And then it's gonna. We'll probably leave a slight bit early to spend a few days in Moab on our way to Mesa Verde, Colorado. And. Um, we're gonna bounce around Colorado for a little bit. That's about as much as we got figured out. I do plan to drop back down and go to uh, Trail Hero in San Hollow again. If we can find a place to stay. I thought we found a place to stay. I thought we were gonna stay where we're staying, Quail Creek. Oh. Yeah. I didn't book that. We need to. Okay. I'm gonna be like 15 <laughs> minutes from San Hollow. Everything booked up for Trail Hero like immediately. Um, so yeah, that's our schedule. Uh, this is not really a six month review. I think we'll do that a separate video. Maybe. Spoiler alert, obviously if we're booking more and planning on a longer stint, we like it. We, we don't have any complaints and I don't see the end in sight anytime soon to this. I have a few complaints. Is it the dog hair? It's the dog hair and the... All right, well, let's save that for another video. <laughs> So yeah, we're going home. Um, I'm excited to see my dad. I miss my dad and uh, yeah, I miss, uh, miss my friend Kurt and a couple others. And the kids are ready to see their friends. Yeah, they're excited about visiting their friends, going back to church. 
yes, we miss our church greatly. We have visited some churches out on the road. Um, we are believers. That's a big part of our life. You know, we're not perfect, but uh, we're followers and uh, 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 oh, up, up, <laughs> up. Sorry about that. <laughs> All right, we're back. <laughs> we had some technical difficulties there. We lost audio. Oh, and more. So excited to see our church friends and family. And uh, maybe my buddy Kurt will cook us a fantastic hibachi meal. Yeah, we haven't said that, but <laughs> we're going to go back and boot stock for a week. So we're thankful yep. that Curtis is going to house us for a week. Because there was a gap between where I could find a campground around our area. And we had like a week to fill. And... Yeah. So we're going to be up in my best friend's backyard for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> which our for our kids get along and and they're awesome so redneck style yeah so that's that's what the future the near future looks like for us and yeah that's that's our schedule um, hope you appreciate the update that is going to be a little bit more realistic update that's a little bit more realistic and uh, maybe we'll start trying to share more of where we're at in a real time basis yeah maybe I don't know if you follow our Facebook or Instagram page, we should, maybe we could like list out at least the days that we're going to be at off-road parks. Yeah. Yeah, that'd probably be good.